hello chappies how is everybody today i hope you're doing all well today i do hope you're doing well i do <laughs> oh how is everybody today oh no we haven't put up yeah damn it i forgot to put right down how many times we died yes once again today we are playing breath of the wild yes we are and we have died so far three Three times we've died. There you go. Oh. There you go. So you don't get. Uh, no, you got my reflection of my face in that one. No. I can't give you. I can't give you the ring light. Glaring ring light. <laughs> How is everybody today? I do hope you're alright. <coughs> oh dear. Sorry. Don't mind me. Don't mind me. I had a go at my dad a moment ago. He nicked my biscuits. He literally nicked my biscuits. He's like, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know it was yours. I'm like, you ate your packet of biscuits the other day, dad. Mm. Anyway. Let's quieten down pretzel. Let's quieten pretzel. There we go. Oh, so. Yeah. Yeah, no, we're all good. We're all good. Everything is looking great everything I had a little bit of a hiccup earlier uh, one drive wouldn't sync uh, so it totally wanted my computer to overrun itself it totally lagged me down but luckily enough we're running okay at the moment let me pop up the task manager yes we are memory looks like it's going a bit full usage of the memory I mean but other than that we're doing good 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 excellent also, you know, Streamlabs, uh, not Streamlabs, uh, Steam. Steam has had another update as well, so we've got that. Oh, yes. And today's tea is Assam. Winings Assam. With a little bit of milk and brown sugar. Nice. Okay, with that, so let's get on to the game. So, what have we done since yesterday? Uh, only a fair bit. Hello there, Serb. Thank you very much for the lurk. It's very much appreciated. We love our lurkers here. I've yet to do an animation for that. Would be nice. Hi. Hi. <laughs> oh, so, uh, what have we done? Let's rewind and talk our way through it. Okay. Okay. How are you doing today, Seb? I hope you're doing well. And pity it all. Yes. That's where we left off last night. I think it was. Yes, it was. We're just about to go talk to a chappy about uh, learning how to paraglide properly. Yes, I believe. That's what it looks like. So it looks like we're going to have to learn how to use updrafts and power gliding to get up to the next mythological beast. There we go. I really should make an animation for Seb and Potatoes. I really should. So, as I said, we went on a bit of shopping spree. Oh, yes. <laughs> I'm good. Excellent. Then I went on a little bit of a climb to go and follow that quest for the young birdling. Found a place, but I never did the shrine, though. Then I was like, oh, we better do some side quests. Uh, the, some of the side quests I've actually, I've actually completed but I haven't turned in yet. So I just dotted about the place turning them in. Nothing important. Then we're like, oh yeah, we still got to find the missus of the dude from the Zora domain. She's in Hyrule Lake. I know that much. So I went down to Hyrule Lake, revealed that, turned it in. And here we are. We're currently at the Zora domain. 
Oh yes, your epileptic inducing new emotes, Nervan. How are you doing? You doing well? Oh, no, yep, yeah, no, you go ahead. Priorities and all that lot. Let's get a shout out for Seb and a shout out for Nervan. There we go. Op four eliminated. Mission successful. Woo! Nice. Oh, I got MVP. What? <laughs> MVP, good. <laughs> whoop, whoop. Yes, yes. I don't know why the pop up's coming up for me. I shouldn't be getting the pop up. I followed you ages ago, Seb. Give it about 10 15 minutes and I'll be able to put the Nervin shout out in. There we go. Okay, so here we are. In doing so, we've now managed to pick up the Zora Demay uh, the Zora Armor headpiece. Which I shall just. There we go. Show you the stats. Zora headgear made from. Dragon scales increases swim speed and allows you to spin attack underwater. <clears throat> well, here's the thing: you can't actually get this headpiece until you've actually created, uh, completed um, Ruta, the Divine Beast. But there's only like a few other places in which you really need the full Zora armor sets. The following is weird. It sometimes removes a font. Does it? Oh dear. How you do that? Um, basically, type in forward slash shout out and then the username. It's what is known, what we are calling at the moment as a Twitch shout out. The other Twitch shout out, known as explanation mark SO, is usually a command for a, com for a chat bot. But you can then also link a thing which is known as Twitch Guru or Psychic. These are clip players which will show a clip when you put in the shout out command. All the chat bot does is say, come watch this uh, uh, streamer at this web address. Yes, the Twitch one is new. Literally came out on beta about two months ago. I got it on the beta. Lucifer Angel got it on the beta. Uh, and 85, uh, 85 didn't. But it has now released for, I assume, for everybody now. Everybody who's on affiliates. <clears throat> yeah. Because I tried to do it the other day on Rune Lowe's channel. And it wouldn't, the command won't come off. So. <laughs> Bugger. <laughs> yeah. But we do have to upgrade that helmet as well. So I don't know what it actually takes to upgrade the Zora helmet. Uh, let's go to the most reliable. Where are you? There you are, the most reliable great fairy. Okay. I think I'll be able to put the Nervins now. S H pop up comes out. Delete at Nervin. Click chat. There you go. Yeah, no, that is the thing. Yeah, you're right. I do smize that. If I was to accidentally click on that heart, it would make me unfollow Nervin. That could be a problem. I never used to get the pop-up for anybody I follow. In fact, it says in the explanation that if you are following that person, you don't get the pop-up. I don't know why I'm getting the pop-up. Oh, Bloopy! I 
finding my best bow. Okay, yeah, that one. And my... Try the frozen one. Don't worry, he won't die. There you go, he's running away. You can start them and you can get rupees for it. Oh, he's back! No, he got scared. I'm not wearing my sneak gear, I'm wearing my Zora gear, so I don't blame that. Just talking about that, I should put on the sneak gear, because if there's any fairy clown here... I don't see any. But then again, I am folding five fairies, so it's very unlikely any will turn up. Talk to the OG Great Fairy! Ah! Ah! Mmm! Greatly. Yes, in heart away. Okay, it's the Zora helmet. What was I actually needed for the new set I picked up the other day? Lawrence horns. Oh, smeg. No, that's the yeah, that's the barber barbarian helm. High tail lizards. Oh, bugger. They're hard to get. Um, we are looking for you. Warm sac warm saffron. Which means we have to go to the desert? Oh no, really? Yeah, I have to go to the desert. Damn it. Anyway, we're here for the Zora helmet. Ah! Yes, please! Mmm! With my new car and Great drove it like a savage And on my way into the town I did a lot of damage I'm gonna fight the big buddy and save this goddamn city And after I am done with that I'll be the hero of Paititi I'm heading to the orphanage to do another riddle Do I hate or love him? I am somewhere in the middle I'm going after those bastards who killed my good friend Sally And after uh -huh. I am done with them they will feel real silly Ooh -wee. Ooh -wee. Mm. Mm. <laughs> By two levels, good oh. All finished Yes please Okay, so what do we need? We need some more hearty bass to make it level 3. Okay, and hearty bass for you and hearty bass for you. Whilst we're here, let's upgrade ah. our climbing gear hats. Mm. Mm. No, I haven't got no more materials, mate. I use them all. There we go.
whilst we're here, we might as well go and pick up some more arrows. Hello, it's me again. Your only customer. Yeah. The Goron. Yes, because we're going to need four fire eyes because we're going to the ice um, fields to learn how to fly. So, equips our fire protective gear. And the Goron hometown. So, how is everybody doing? I hope you're doing all well. I do hope you're doing well. I believe it's still being chilly over there. There we go. There we go. No, don't you set my bow alight. Don't want that. Thank you. Yeah, we're okay. For you. Okay. All on the stream. Hello, matey. This is the only store which don't sell normal arrows because they can't because they burn up. need more arrows no doubt but i think we're gonna be okay um now if i remember rightly there is a safe space around here somewhere where i can take the armor off. Stop wearing anything. This is the painter, and he's a Hyrulean. Why the heck is he not wearing protective armor? You talk to him, and he says the fact that he can't brush because oh, he's using a fire elixir. Okay. Yeah, he uh, gives us a strict description as to where one of the memories is.
Wood, north of the Woodland Stable. There's some interesting high ground that looks nice. Okay, we're just going to have to fast travel over there. I went to the wrong one. Oops. But we haven't done this shrine, so we'll go and do this shrine whilst we're here. Yes. Yes, they create sparks, so you can also use the magnesis ability on them to use them <laughs> to fling them all over the place. It's quite funny. Okay, red gateway. Oh. Okay, let's get our gear on. Okay, so we've got a metal block, we've got a ball, the ball obviously has to go there. Obviously they want us to time something or other. But, I don't think we need to do that at all. What the hell? One. Okay, so yeah. Bubble. No, I can get that sorted. That's easily sorted. Yeah, that's easily sorted. Okay. <laughs> I should have looked at the floor first. I mean, we did one similar to this pre the other day. So... Can we reach it? Oh, you sneaky sensors! We can't actually reach it from there. Unlike with the previous one. We are going to have to initially do this the right way then. Yeah, the ball went down here. 
Okay, so if we need that there. Then we just put the ball on the slope behind that, then move that. I think that will be close enough. out of time with that platform at all. I'll we'll check there isn't any... Double check there isn't any other secret chest about the place! Because they can be sneaky sometimes. There'll be no sneaking around here. Yay! It's a dancing bean rainbow queen! Oh, you'd like to spend the purple smearable? Yes! Yes. I'm on my knees. I'm proposing to you. Sorry. Not really my type. That's not my horse. Like, how has this happened? This is just mental. Well, that earned a massive eye roll. An eye roll for a Rick roll. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Now, quick. There we go. So we need. Well, actually, no. We bought this yesterday. This is the snow quill set, or as we like to call it, the um, the bird people sets. What are they called again? Re Rito, Rito, the Rito set. And it gives you a cold resistance ability i do not know what the class set is uh, aka all freezes of armor because i haven't actually upgraded them to level two yet i need as i've discussed we need the the heat resistant herb i can't remember what it's called but this stuff is more than good enough to actually cope with the cold weather around here. So. This here is the uh, shield surfing course. I uh, did try my hand at it previously, but I am not too confident in myself too much at the moment. Oh, there's another shop about. Oh yes, it's underneath me somewhere, isn't it? No, there's a monster underneath me somewhere. Yes, I remember. Yeah, there's a mon um, big massive ice monster underneath me. Shielding, is it? Okay. Well, we met the Detritus at Downhill, I guess it is the best way to go. Oh, there's an Ice Wizard. 
Now I'm supposed to. What am I supposed to get? I'm supposed to get a picture of an ice wizard. And I need a fire rod. Turn around so we can get a good picture of you. There we go. I think I'm supposed to get a picture of an ice wizard. Let's have a look. Uh, from the ground up, little sister's big request. Weapon, weapon commissar. That's what I need the fire rod for. Um, road to respect. Fireproof release of round up. Freezing. Oh no. He actually wants the rod. He doesn't want the actual... Damn it. Ah, oh, damn it, that's a blizzard rod. Do I want to pick up a blizzard rod? Those are useless. They're useless and inaccurate, but Blizzard Rod might come in handy. my fire sword. There it is. Oh! Oh! Poor lizard man! Oh, poor lizard man. It's a man alone. Where 
Where is that blooming shrine then? Is it underneath us? It's got to be underneath us. Somehow. a red fallen star you only get them from the DLCs so careful there's one of those ice rock monsters down there by the looks of it One of these, this is. What? He's chucking snowballs at me. Wait. I've got a little, um, where is it? Uh, there it is. Collaborations with the Xeno uh, Blade Chronicles 2. Summer sky from the middle of the largest bridge. That's obviously Hyrulean Lake. Uh, the problem is, is the dragon's still around about there. So I've been like just running through that. Eastern sky from the skull of the left eye. Okay, no, we didn't. We went there during the night. The southern eastern sky from the peak of the tall pierced snowy mountain. That's the one we've just done. Okay. <laughs> Salvage trousers. That's uh, a salvage of trousers. Swim speed up. Collaboration with Xenoblade Chronicles 2. Essential gear used by a boy who seeks sunken treasure in the cloud sea. They're rather rare to find. Oh. Does this mean I'll be out of... That suggests scuba diving gear. Now I've seen Link wearing a pair of goggles. I just assumed that was a cosmetic. We're going to have to go try and find the other stuff now, aren't we? Let's... Yeah, okay. <laughs> that way. Apparently there is a shrine near here. Is it one of the ones which is hidden in the cliff face somewhere where I have to blow it with, some tea, uh, with a bomb or an arrow? Could be. It 
is the big, the tallest peak. It is the tallest peak, but where in the tallest peak is it? It's got to be under here. No, there it is. Yeah, I see it. Okay. Uh, I've got a meteor rod. Should I use that on it? used to do back in the old day, get some wood. <laughs> get... Stop pressing the map button, Gemma. I know that's menu on other games, but that's not menu on this game. My fire sword. <laughs> Looks like it's changed. It finished. Finished melting. Okay, have we got any wooden? No. Don't want to waste my fire sword on you. Ugh! I could literally just totally crawl up the damn thing. Oh, it is going. It's just going slower. Okay, that's cool. It's Sheikah anyway, so I don't think it's made out of wood. Hmm. Hey. There's the monster. He just came to life. be having to use cr oh do you set foot in the shrine i am gora ah in the name of the goddess of hyrule i offer this trial major test of no 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 especially not with water about me i ain't got no electric um uh resistance potions <laughs> I will do minor ones at this stage, but I won't do major ones. Oh dear, it froze me in here again. And it looks like the lizard's gone, but his axe is still here. Oh no. 
sheer ice, ice cliffs as well. <laughs> oh no. Okay, let's just uh, go back to the shrine over here. We did that in the last stream, at the end of the last stream. This is where we literally have to do the mission. When I looked in here, it looks like we're going to have to be paragliding about and shooting arrows at the same time. Whilst learning how to use updrafts. will be okay. Actually, pretty busy here. You should probably go. I should have took a screenshot. I've got one of those, haven't I? Uh, yes, here it is. Apparently, it's very good for the draw. Very quick draw, apparently. Not why I've ever found drawing a problem. Mm -hmm. Did you need something? I'm busy here. Can I help you? Hmm. Va me de. Let me get this straight. Some random high Lorian wants to help me bring down the divine beast, Medir. I'm not buying it. What's your name, stranger? I'm Link. Hmm. Link, hmm? Well, Link. I'm Teba. But you already knew that. I'm guessing the Elder asked you to come here and talk some sense into me. Am I right? That's right. <laughs> Just like the Elder, to trust any fool wandering into the town. No, he trusted somebody with a Sheikah slate on his hip. They think I'm the descendant of me, myself. <laughs> Look, he seemed like an alright guy, but let's make one thing clear. I'm not going anywhere. As a Rito warrior, I can't rest until my people are safe. There's only one way I'm going to get back to Rito village, and that is... Hmm. Once the Vine Beast... Meda falls from the sky. He's not going to fall from the sky, though. He's, he's going to go and sit on a mountain somewhere and point a beam at the Hyrolean castle. If I have to kill Meda, so be it. Only then will I return to the village. Then let's get started. Mm -hmm. Are you serious? Mm. Ah! Well, far, far be it from me to talk you out of the... To take talk you off of the ledge. But, it's as the Elder said, the only way to stop the Divine Beast is to get inside it. Fat chance of that happening. There's no way we can set foot. Actually! <laughs> so not only are, you, only are you English, you're brainless too. Let's fill you in. The only people able to enter the Divine Beast are five champions of old. And unfortunately for us, the rest of Hyrule, and the rest of Hyrule, they, had, they died hundred years ago. If it hadn't been for Ganon, hmm. never mind. Let's focus on bringing down murder one step at a time. If we approach murder recklessly, its cannons will blast us out of the sky before we get close. So, I'm going to need to test you before I take you with me. We toe warriors use the updraft in this ravine to hone our aerial artery skills. 
the updrafts are so strong that a person could just open up a cloth over their head and float up easily. Mm. Now let's see what you're capable of. I'll have to manoeuvre through the air and destroy five of the targets set up in this valley in three minutes. Oh dear. Many pointers. Hmm. Using a bow in mid-air is just like using a bow in the ground. Yeah, but it also slow mows. But you'll probably want to uh, a bow suited to long-range engagements. Use your arrows to destroy five targets in three minutes. If you can't do that, it doesn't stand a chance against murder. Are you ready? Okay, hmm. then. Hundreds of them, technically. Hmm. I believe it. Link, I feel I've heard the name somewhere before. Well, if you really want to help me bring down murder, it's now or never. I'll get you into position so you can give the its give its cannons all you got. Hmm. Inside the treasure chest is a bow I've modified. Take it and let me know when you're ready. Treasure chest. Oh, this treasure chest. Oh, quick shot. This most favoured among the Richo warriors. Uh, the bow string has been specially engineered for aerial combat, which allows it to be drawn uh, drawn faster than normal ones. But this one apparently has a special quick shot. Uh, we got to get rid of one. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Now before we go and do this, because this means getting uh, starting another Divine Mind Beast, I'm going to go and get myself a fresh cup of uh, tea, and uh, we'll be right back. In doing so, I can stick us on the Be Right Back screen, and I'm going to play some shout outs. Okay. Be right back, literally. Don't you worry, chappies. <laughs>
Is there a sure shot on this map? Oh, Josh, found out information. There is a Bowie knife on Moon. Oh, that's... Yep. It's on the stairs uh, that you use to get to Captain where the, where the crawlers usually get to. Uh, you have to jump up to it. Long on this one. Ugh. Okay. See? <laughs> it's gone! You wouldn't even know. Hang on. Oh, no. Just do that. There you go. You wouldn't even know. <laughs> you wouldn't even know. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Concealed and carry. Okay, right. This is this is where this is where it gets a little bit, you know, risque. With uh... oh, there we go. <laughs> that is a seventeen CL. Oh my god. Are you okay? <laughs> oh god. <laughs> Does this even fit to be shown on TV? Like, this, this seems like torturous. I don't know. This world seems Let's get out of here. Yeah, we having a whole bunch of fun over here because that's 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 what you do when you come in my hall. I mean, wait, no, fuck, no, don't clip that. <laughs> Too late. <laughs> yeah, it was something like that. So, here I can whistle to get my horse as well. I mean, there are some similarities to Red Dead Red. Like, like, shit. Yeah, like that. Oh. <laughs> mm. Some similarities. No. <laughs> shit, I have to stay focused. <laughs> <laughs> Back, 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 back
Christ! <laughs> Son says Soul Academy. Uh, <laughs> Yes, I gotta Sorry. make him an animation as well. I gotta make Lusty Bard an animation. Bad. The big old fatties. Yeah. I don't, uh. I don't partake very often, EQ. So. There we go. Sorry, I'm just adjusting my mic. You could probably hear the difference. There we go. A little bit of a fiddle. Try to make it so I stop headbutting it. There we go. Let's try that. Yeah, I'm not going to headbutt that anytime soon. <laughs> Oh, I've only got three explosive arrows left, but then again, I don't know what I'm going to be doing. Oh, I forgot to turn off pretzel. Again, it wasn't gameplay, so we're okay. There we go. Okay, so. Hmm. It's time to fight East the Divine Beast. Normal war arrows won't put a dent on those cannons. You'll need to hit them with bomb arrows. I've only got three left. Oh, shoot. He's only given me 20. Also, it'll be cold up there. Yeah, I'm wearing... So what's the plan? Hmm. I'll draw this fire. That'll be your chance to destroy the cannons. There's four cannons in total. The main body is protected by a barrier. So there's no use for it, uh, no use attacking it. Just focus on taking out all the cannons. Wait a second. Hmm. Only because I want to save. Only because I want to save. <laughs> That's all. It's only because I want to save. I want a hard copy save, please. Hmm. I'm ready. Hmm. Let me ask you something. Why are you doing this? Why risk your life to bring down murder? rescue Zelda. Hmm. Zelda. But that's the name of the princess uh, Ravely served a hundred years ago at Hyrule Castle. I don't know what she has to do with it. Divine Beast, but whatever. As long as you're helping me bring down murder, your motivations are fine by me. Right, get on. Here we go. Shoot! Hmm. Alright, it's showtime. Man, even I feel like I'm going to freeze up here. I've never done this one before. There's the Divine Beast. It has its barrier up again. 
What's wrong, Link? Too scared to talk? Link never talks! Let's go over the plan. Hmm. You see those cannons? I'll draw their fire. While I'm doing that, you use your bomb arrows to destroy the cannons. Got it so far? If you need to withdraw a bit, just be uh, spread your cloth and float straight up in the updraft for a while. I'll take that as a sign you need to regroup. Don't bother aiming for anything covered by the barrier. It's impenetrable. And whatever you do, don't get close enough to touch it. Hmm. And finally, I know I said this a few times already, but don't forget cold protection. So I don't be an idiot. We're wearing our good gear. Garden shield will be the best. Yep. And let's see if we've got any extending stamina food. No, I don't. Okay, but I do have stamina's. Okay, there we go. You ready? Let's go. Let's go. All right. Now, let's go blow up those cannons. It's on you. Okay. That's a bit low. in the ice. Still better than the ice, Aruta. I don't care what anybody says, it looks more like a vulture to me. <laughs> well done, Link. That thing is history. 
Ooh, there's a garden up there. Well, it looks like a garden. Lapitas. Comes down to strategy with right tactics, you can able to defeat an entire group of enemies all at once. Travel gate registered to map. Well, now, I've seen that face before. Bastard. I had a feeling you would show up eventually, but making me wait a hundred years is a bit indulgent. You're here to wrest control of Meadow away from Ganon, correct? If so, then the first thing you'll want to do is find yourself a map. Yep. Okay. That guidance stone has the information for the layout of this divine beast. Can you make it there? Dude is an arrogant so and so. air currents instead of water or what was in Rudanda Rudanda again I can't remember okay uh, metal blocks Lucifer's angel hello Lucifer how are you doing you doing all right I do hope you're well I'll wait for you to come into chat first okay are these movable? No, they're not. Okay. Oh, I see. Ah. Okay. They move that way. The mobile blocks move that way. But the railed blocks move that way. They're not targetable. How do we move those? Yes, I'm well. I'm well. I do hope you're well. <laughs> uh, congratulations for last night, by the way. Well done. Very well done. I saw the photo. There we go. Let's get Lucifer a shout out, shall we? Was involved and uh, <laughs> VIP ness, it is indeed. Yes, it is indeed. There we go. Hmm. Oh, there's a chest down there. Chest up there. Hmm. 
Let's concentrate on getting the map first, shall we? In there. Oh, he dropped a shiny little spear. Oh. Uh, ooh. Let's get the map. Oh, dear, oh, dear, oh, dear. Wet and cold as usual, Lucifer, isn't it? As I said earlier, I had to have a go at my daddy because he nicked my fucking biscuit. Oh! Found out a shout-out player that works two. Two variants. One that plays a clip and one that comes up with their username and picture. Oh. Miserable, yes, yes, totally miserable. Absolutely. Is that the one which, the same one which uh, Tom Tay and Sven use? I don't know the name of that one. I did try it at one point, but it wouldn't allow me to change the colour. <laughs> colour was perfect for you, though. Divine Beast controls have been enabled. So what are the controls on this one then? You'll need to look closely at your map of the Divine Beast. I've done two of these so far, matey. I've never done this one before. The terminals that will activate Meadow are marked by those glowing points. No sugar, Sherlock. You'll need to activate all of the terminals to take back control. Think you're up to it. This dude is arrogant. Okay, okay. Oh. Is it Meadow that controls these? Let's have a look. It looks like I raise and lower the wings. The other question is, why is this damn thing called Meadow? Looks like it's only the main body that rotates as well. Ah, oh, there's an eye up there. Okay. Still the one on the bottom that needs to be done. I was to can he be pushed any more forward? Apparently not. Oh, that's as far as the magnesis will work. Okay, let's um Okay, we 
got that. Let's try. If I was to do that, I'd have to be much, much quicker. Okay. <clears throat> okay, that's how we get back up there. I see an eyeball. Okay, careful. No, okay, we're gonna have to try and do it. Somehow shot the ceiling. going to hit the ceiling. Number one down. There are four terminals remaining. Still a ways to go. Arrogant. Wind machines. What was that? Oh, that's one of those things which spawn those uh, funky skull heads.
the sister. Okay. And then I'll have to use Magnesis to drag that all the way back here. Can you climb this bit? Can I have to do it with such force that it will actually slam into that outfit? Okay. Yeah, it needs to slam. Three terminals remaining. Keep going. Is that chest magnetic? No, it's not. Then how the heck are we supposed to get up there? <laughs> Now I assume what we've got to do is make ourselves to the next wing. Oh, that's an eyeball. Not what we need, but welcome. Okay. Okay, we've got to find the eyeball for that. The moss this was turned at one point. I swear I saw an eyeball. Or something tucked in one of the beams whilst it was turned. Anyway, um... You there? Um, maybe. So. 
no, that's not going to do it. We do need to clear that. But where is the eyeball for that? what we need. Glide um, uh, over? I'm not too confident my... Hmm. Oh, bits! Hello. I love the sun. My raspberry pie working. No, they never work bits. They never do. Sup? <laughs> the sun is shining. No, it's not. It's the raining. The air is flowing. It's freezing. <laughs> mm. But I'm glad somebody at least is having fun. Okay, look, there's another one. How the hell are we supposed to get up to these chests? <laughs> That's a really bad angle, that was. Yes, it is cold. It is cold. Okay. Okay. Oh. I know what I'm supposed to do there. But here. Okay, which side am I on? With that side... No, that's not going to do that. Hmm. Ah. It was. Okay, it's enough. Yeah. Cold, cold, cold. Cold, cold. There are two terminals remaining. He's almost, almost there. He's sounding all optimistic now. see because that wind's in the way. Okay, turn that off for now. Right, so we've got this stone here. Okay. It's another one of those plunger stones. Oh, 
I see? Yeah, no, okay. Yep, 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 yep. We do need the wind. There we go. There it is. Oh, it's an iron ball. It's a ball, everybody! Close you up. Now we have magnesis, but I very much doubt we can actually go through here to trigger it. Too far away. Yeah, okay. So we're going to have to use the tilt. That was a bit too quick. Did it. Good, good, good. We're getting there. We're getting there, everyone. I've never done this dungeon, this uh, divine beast before. So, bits, how are you? What you been up to recently? Just one terminal remaining. <laughs> what do you know? It's underneath us, apparently. Okay, let's try and use this updraft and this draft here. <laughs> All okay, and yes, no, I'm well, I can't complain. I oh, didn't, I uh, didn't. Was that it? No, we don't want a knight's claymore. They're pointless. Coming you back up. Keep an eye out. Nope. 
Oh yeah. <laughs> you can't grapple this stone. Yeah, we're just missing one eyeball. Yeah, I know, I know, I know. See if there's an eyeball the other side. <laughs> really, I've got nine arrows left. Oh god, what well, eight now? Some point I have to. Oh, okay. Well, I didn't know this. The last terminal is over there. You can see it. But how do we get over there? There's no carriage. reminds me of uh, battling on top of the almighty in the red war maybe if I use oh, okay. this is obviously where we're gonna have to battle the big boss at the end it's the control towers over there the building. <laughs> that was the last terminal. Yes, it was. Now you just need to start the main control unit. I want you to take a good look at your map. There should be a new glowing point on there. He's so arrogant. Well, 
flap to it. You full well know we don't have wings. I think I wish I had my. Okay, so. I assume this is what I was supposed to do. Still don't like it. Whoa, I'm going in the ceiling. Okay, let's level her out before we go up top. one I can't figure out how to get to. First toilet's bow, yeah. And from the video, uh, the, sorry, cutscene, which was shown, um, I think there's probably one on the front of the bird as well. I don't think I should have gone down here. Yeah, I, I totally shouldn't have gone down here. Oh well, there's a platform underneath this which I believe leads to the main body. armor in this game which is really super e uber rare right which will enable us oh no I don't like this no oh I know what I'm supposed to do yeah I know what no it's only the wings that change position Jim okay I know what I'm supposed to do yeah side are we on? Are we on this side? Bring that one up. Can we get there? Can we get there? No, 
not exactly what we needed, but still good. Okay, here we go, here we go. Sorry, I have to constantly remind myself what the jump button is. Bits and craft a. Did we give bits and craft a actual? No, I don't think we did. We'll give him one. There we go. There we go. There you go. A Twitch follow for bits and craft. Now again, I have never done this one before. I have no idea. Oh. oh god well we found ice arrows so it might be that is one of Ganon's own, and it plays dirty. He defeated me 100 years ago, but only because I was winging it. I can't believe I'm actually saying this, but you must avenge me, Link! <laughs> I know, I know. Calm down, matey. <laughs> you need a prep. temperature at the moment? I can't tell. It's probably nothing because on the other Divine Beast it didn't matter so let's put our... Oh he is cold. Damn it. Okay we're up to 22. Takes us down to 15. 28. Okay, that, that'll do. That'll do. That'll do. Our best bow. I've only got seven explosive arrows left. Shall use the master sword because it's glowing. Get on, watch yourself. Yeah, okay, we will. Oh, he's gone. 
where you go. Faces. <laughs> Maybe I should turn to explosive arrows? Hmm. Oh, I got too close. <laughs> I shouldn't have been greedy. I shouldn't have been greedy. I should have just gone up there with a sword. Have I got any proper just help food? No, I don't. Okay. Keep your yep. head in the game. Oh dear. Out of our marrows. Out for marrows. now Dude! 
food. You can use the columns to shield yourself. I am. But I'm not actually using the columns, I'm using the terminal. to release the beast. Once you activate the main control unit, you will not be able to re-enter the interior of the Divine Beast. Yes, I know, there's only one chest by the looks of it, which I never wasn't able to get. Do you wish to still activate it? Yes. I'll be plucked. Yeah, you will you defeated be. defeated him, eh? <laughs> who would have thought? Yep, we know who you are. Well done. I suppose I should thank you now that my spirit is free. This returns Meadow back to its rightful owner. <laughs> Don't preen yourself just for doing your job. You do. I do suppose you've proven your value as a warrior. A warrior worthy of my unique ability. The sacred skill that I have dubbed Ravali's Gale. This is one I've really wanted. We can now take off from land. Can create your own updraft. It's now time to move on and start making preparations for Meadow Strike on Ganon. But only if you think you'll still need my help while you're fighting inside Hyrule Castle. Feel free to thank me now. Or never mind, just go. Your job is far from finished, you know. Yes, far from it. The princess has been waiting an awful long time.
Oh, come on. You'll have a precise speed on Ganon from this vantage point. And when the time is right, give him everything you've got. Now we wait for that perfect moment. <laughs> Meadow, we've been artfully patient for the last 100 years. I doubt you'll suffer a feather over a few more moments. <laughs> After all these years, I simply must admit the truth. Even without the power of flight, Link made his way to this divine beast and accomplished something that even I could not. I guess I was wrong about how lucky he would be. I hope that luck holds out, Link, for everyone's sake. Ravali's Gale, a blusterous power born from the spirit of the champion Ravali, creates an updraft that carries you into the sky. Activate by charging your jump with X. Okay. Yep. There he is. There's Mada or Mado Meadow. All those rocks falling down surely would have hit someone. Okay. <laughs> so it looks like we get three blasts of it. Okay. Ah, okay. How long does the updraft last? Hmm. At uh, 10 seconds. Okay. It's good to know. Okay, let's, um, what does the mission say? Obviously nothing, but I'm sure there's somebody who wants to say something to us. Yes, here we go. You, I really owe you for what you did. Are, they, are you her? It's fine. Thanks for my wife. I've been, I've recovered from the point where I can stand. Actually, my wife told me something about you. She says you're the descendant of Champion. Hmm. Go on, there's nothing to hide. Your bowmanship, the way you move through the air, there's no doubt about it, you are the bloody Champion. What? You look like you've got something else to say, actually. Hmm. Don't tell me. You're the Hyronian Champion. Ha! <laughs> Good one, pal. <laughs> Everyone knows that all uh, that all of the champions were wiped out by Calamity Ganon a hundred years ago. And they, even if they survived that, they'd be old geezers with canes instead of swords. Let the Elder know about what happened to Divine Beast Mudder, but you should probably go talk to him. Yeah, I'm going to. Good hoots! Hello! Oh. You have done it, and you have survived. That's that. 
you conquered the great beast. Oh, the divine beast, sorry. Uh, to think the beast has taken roost on the top of the village. It looks simply divine. If the legends are true, the light from the divine beast will ra ravage the calamity. For now, the divine beast will become the protector of this village and live on the, in legend alongside you. <laughs> oh yes, of course, I must reward you properly. Feel free to take what you find in the treasure oh. chest. You will get more use out of it. Oh. Champion Descendants, I have only just realised that the sword you have in your possession. Yeah, I'm still wearing it. Mm, I wonder if that changes the storyline. Could it be the sword that seals the darkness? The Hyrulean champion who fought alongside Master Ravali a hundred years ago. Could that be you? Yeah, that's what I've been trying to tell you all this time, mate. Yeah, I got the Master Sword on my back. I didn't need it. But it was glowing in the presence of the Calamity, so that tale is true. <laughs> this should be the ultimate weapon of this region. The Great Eagle's Bow. A bow without equal wielded by Rito the Champion, Rivali. Uh, the re by re the Rito Champion, Rivali. It's said Rivali could loose arrows with the speed and gale, making him supreme in aerial combat. There we go. Cool. Okay, I've got to go talk to a blackbird now. See if he's alright, because he was grumpy. Here you are, matey. Oh, so you're the dude I come to to fix the bow, I bet. Hmm? You got the Great Ego Bow from the Elder Right. If you break or lose the Great Ego Bow, you can make a new one. I can make a new one for you. But you'll need to bring me a shallow bow, five bundles of wood, and a diamond. Yeah, all of these always cost a diamond. But we know where to get one diamond for a ten luminous, so that's all right. Okay, cool. Oh. oh yeah, no, the singing started, doesn't it? I, I... She went off flying to the range, mate. She said she wanted to go there earlier. Kiel, where are you? I can't feel Kiel, can't find Kiel anywhere. Where could she be? She went off to the range. I'm sure she's fine, mate. Hyrulean doing here? Huh? Well, I just realised that you're Hyrulean. You're just wandering around Hyrulean trying to find... Yes. I'm here on my honeymoon, but this town is seriously a hole. In Grodo Town, then, they got jewellery to buy. Zora Domain um, is always a hoot with all of the weird, squishy fish people. Aww. But here, I just want to go home already. Oh, really? Aww. Give me a break already. I can't believe my husband brought me here for our honeymoon. He already apologised, but if he doesn't want a divorce, I told him he'd better bring me a baked apple. That's easy. Apple on my eye. Uh, baked apple is easy. Apple on my eye. Uh, Jun Ri, currently in Rito Village on her honeymoon, is about to blow her stack if she can't find what she's looking for. Distracting her from her troubles with a baked apple, her favourite snack, is one way to lighten her mood. Bring Jerry a baked apple to save her marriage. That's easy. Um... We need a stove. I don't think there's any stoves around. There's a stove down the bottom. Don't go far, Jenny. Daru 
Luke's protection is now ready to roll. There it is. Now, we don't actually cook a baked apple. What you do to make a baked apple is just... Oh dear, I gave all my apples to my horse. <laughs> oh well, skipping that. Sit by the... No, I don't want to sit, I want to talk to the birdie. I hate practicing singing. Who cares if I'm not a good singer? Sai, all of this pressure is making me hungry. I want some salmon manaries. Now, we already brought all the clothings. Yeah. Ah. All of them, please. <laughs> Thank you. Hi. All of them, please. You two plotting. Aww. Fishy, fishy. No one's selling fishy. If I could buy any fishy, I can't fi find it. Finish my task. Aww. Maybe I'll just like be like high out and catch one myself. Who's high out? Aye. Cree is good at counting. She always counts customers that come in. To the slippery falcon every day. Let's see, you were. Oh, I forgot. Probably the only one, mate. No, we don't need a name. That's. We gotta recruit her to the town, obviously. Uh, how many souls do we have? I don't know. Let's check. We have five! Good, let's get another stamina se section. Hyrule. Even if we were to defeat Calamity Ganon, it's not going to bring peace to Hyrule. Hello! Okay. Okay, so that means we only have one divine beast left, everybody. And that's in the south. This section here. Which is desert. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, what was that? Oh, I never entered it, did I? Yeah, that was a shrine of major te a test of strength. Okay, so we're going to... Yeah, let's go back down, because I just went down there because I had to go and get the... Uh missing wife apparently she got washed away by Ruta's uh, storm surge all the way down there there is a connecting river but it's a hell of a long way you would have thought she would have ended up in the swampland actually so we'll go here do this trial Yay! We've got three Divine Beasts on the loading screen now. I wonder what this is. D 
Don't be another test of strength, please. We don't want that. No, it's not. What's this? To you who sets foot in the shrine, I am Yei Naga. In the name of the goddess of Hyrule, I offer you this trial. Shift. Shatters the heavens. Shatters the heavens. Oh. 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 Just gotta check for hidden treasures, yes, first. There. Well, there's a. There's a. Bomb siphon here. There you go. Oh, okay. Kinesis mixed with bomb. Okay. Okay, so set the bomb first in. Step back a little bit. Can we use this? Because I doubt this is going to work. Oh, it does work. <laughs> oh, God. Damn you. I probably don't even need to do the bomb trick now that I've got up the draft. I could probably just fly up there. But, uh, oh well. Whee! <coughs> oh. That's where this secret chest is. Not very secret, but yeah. Well, I can't use my I can't use my secret powers in here. Interesting. Okay. I've never had cause to use my secret powers, so I say secret powers my ancient powers or whatever. Oh dear. Ay ay ay. I about I need better timing. I need better timing. I need all the uh, small size cores I can get for um, guardian gear. using ancient technology attack up plus eight yeah you I mean who's me into the toy is gonna be full um yeah let's finally get rid of you I don't need you
dear. Good news and bad news, everybody. Good news. But no, bad news. Uh, Dad's eating crisps. Good news, they're not chicken flavoured. There we go. Making a campfire. Yeah, we know. We all know how to do that. Put some wood down and set it alight. Several ways of doing it. Using a flint and steel. Or using a fire weapon of some sort. This is Hyrule Lake, a Hyrulean Lake. It's a featured in many and many of Zelda games. The closest one that's resembled this Hyrulean Lake is actually from the Twilight Princess. There's the original area which we were in known as the Great Plateau with the church on the corner. There's the Battling Twins. That's where we've got to go. Mm. So first off, I think what would be best is if we were to teleport to you, maybe? Yes, let's teleport to you. Because as you can see, yeah, that's where the path goes. I mean, either that, or we can actually come from this end up through here. But... Hmm... Hmm... I don't know. Yeah, let's go this way first. Let's go this way first. I got a few heat resistant potions. So we're okay by the way. And the reason why I'm not um, exploring the north now that uh, the Divine Beast is gone that much, I'll do that after we've actually got to the main settlement in here because there's some herbs which we need from the desert region to increase the defensiveness of our cold armour. Which will help us actually do everything we need to do in the North Cold area. Which includes things like getting photos of a skeleton horse. <laughs> yeah. And we've still got a lot of other tri trials to do. We've got to do this. That is a trial. I haven't even bothered to step foot in there yet. Yes, that's an actual trial. Uh, the Thunder Plains here, again, I haven't initiated that, but that's actually a trial as well. Um, I believe we've initiated the Master Sword Trials as well. The only, only sort of point where it says that we have to go and talk to the Dooku Tree. Um... We're not at the point of uh, killing any of the dragons yet. Although previously, all I've actually ever done is kill two dragons. I think it was two dragons. Yeah, I killed... I killed the poor dragon up here. Yeah, there's a dragon on this mountain here. 
And he's actually been, I'm sorry to say, and sorry to spoil it. I mean, you can see the garbage flying right there. Um, he's been corrupted by the Calamity. So he's actually very ill and very poorly. And another one which is actually down here. And I only killed him because I actually kind of like cheated and actually kept going up and down a waterfall. Because I had the Zora armor. Yes, we've got to go that way. Now we can just literally fly straight across or we can follow the uh, road. I don't know what you guys want me to do. Shall I just follow the road? I think it would be better if I follow the road. Let's follow the brain. Because we might come across the stables. There are... What the hell is that? Is that stables? I don't know, let's find out. Well, there's a shrine anyway. I can go. I can see that. I might have to come back here. There's a lot of stuff to forage here. hate what mate i don't like the look of you you've got a lot and you've not got a name coming up on your speech bubble hey oh good <sighs> it's usual unusual to see someone out here traveling alone where's you headed south oh that's the same as me so you're going to the Faron grasslands hmm mm hmm you want to hear my short story Oh, I'll tell you. It was a while back. I'd lost my best friend, a horse. I'd been travelling with her with for years and years. And then I heard this tale of a fountain in the Sparren Grasslands. A magical fountain that can revive lost horses. Oh, it's one of the great... It's the great fairy which revives horses, yeah. The other sister, which the sisters don't talk about. Um, yeah, which I believe, yep, yeah, there it is, see look, Lake of the Horse God, we are going south. Another shrine, apparently. Oh, <laughs> sorry, horses, run away. Yay, yeah, they're running away. We're good. Run 
run, Wolsey, run. Come. Good, Wolsey. Um, not very much, mate. I love the fact that you're almost literally every place. What are you looking for? Why are you selling? What have you got? <laughs> As usual, we shall take all your arrows, Beetle. Yeah, yeah. Yay. <laughs> there we go. Now we're going to have to sell you something because we're getting broke again. Oh. <laughs> Okay, the lady in Broad the lady in Grudo Gr Grudo, yeah, Grudo. I don't know. The lady up at the volcano, she wants topaz now, so we can actually start selling our amber. Wow! <laughs> Again, we're still gonna need to keep some of our, uh, keep our luminous. Wow! And we need to keep our diamonds. And we need to keep our flints. No, goodbye. <laughs> See you again. Is there any rumours in here? Yes, there is. Super Rumour Mill EX Volume 3. Ah, oh, it's an EX. Okay, I don't know what that was about. I've just got a pop-up on my screen. Oh, Twitter. Bugger off, Twitter. I've loved rumour since before I was born. In fact, I was the first to report on my rumoured birthday. Trassy here. This time I've got a juicy bite of gossip I've been dying to share. Ancient horse gear is real and it's fabulous. Apparently there's some incredible horse gear from Hyrulean's distant past, Hyrule's distant past. I'm talking the long, long, long ago, folks. The bridle that increases your horse's skill and a saddle that can instantly summon your horse to your side. The bridle is south of the Hyrule Ridge, beneath the cherry blossom tree at a mountain where creatures gather. A sad, the, the saddle is a is at a mysterious spring where the horse spirit resides. At least that's what the rumors say. The ancients liked horses, uh, liked to horse around. I need that gear. Uh, the abilities are good, but the actual gear itself looks crap. Hello, artist. Check out my album. Oh, that's ah. easy. I know where that is. That's Hyrulean Lake, and that's literally a tree on the edge of Hyrulean Lake. Scouts Hill, or perhaps a little further east of there. I'm not exactly hunting them down at the moment. I want to try and get all the regions unlocked first, you know, all the map uncovered. Then we'll go and in one stream go and get all of them. Because that's a it's a it's a lot of cutscenes. A lot of cutscenes. Ah. 
Well, we know where to get hammer. guys let's get to talking animations again shall we um yeah um where's my bad owner gone there it is oh <laughs> yes you did man dog you did thank you very much for coming very weird how your shout out hasn't happened i mean your um not shout out <laughs> Thank you, Lisa. She's gonna attack. Oh, no. Did she just did she just call me a fuck face? I know, for some strange reason Lucifer can hear the track. I get it, I get it, I do. A whole new world in the stable music. Oh, okay. Okay. So you're in your late lunch break, are you? Okay, that's cool. That's cool. Well, okay, so let's recap for Mandog, shall we? Yeah, we know how to register a horse, thank you. I've got two of them. I need to pause the menu. Okay, we'll get to that in a second. To you who says full in the shrine, I am Kai K Mackie. Mackie? Mackie? Metal doors open the way. Oh, that's going to be easy. I think that's going to be easy. Anyway, not the point. The point is... Uh, updating my dog. We have... So... Do -do 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 -do. Where did we start off from? Oh, yeah, there we go. So far, we have we have actually completed Divine Beast um, in the north. We have also got the a sacred weapon of the Ritu birds. Um, yes, egotistical bird gave me powers as well. I have the ability to <coughs> create updrafts if I charge my ju jump. So I can actually take off from the air now. So the usual, yes. The usual. The actual um, the actual Divine Beast wasn't actually that tricky. Not really. It was a little bit worrying when I had to actually go onto the top of the bird and actually tilt the wings to power glide from wing to wing. But that was about it. Yes, so if I fart harder than I'll float, yes. Sure enough. Sure enough. There we go. And here we are, now in another shrine. Um, We do... I, You were here. Well, you weren't here, but you were in that stream. We do have now have the Master Sword. So, there we go. There's the secret bow of the bird people. I destroyed the um, stone shatterer. Yeah, I destroyed that. I really need to get rid of the ceremonial trident. I do not need it anymore. It's a useless piece of junk. I never use it. I never do because it's so low level. Metal. Oh. Platforms. Oh, I hear you. Get away from me. There you go. I really shouldn't actually have that. It's just a normal guardian sphere. Okay, we are looking for secret chests, secret chests, secret chests. Uh, 
Okay, there's some more doors. Oh, hello! Damn, this bow is good. I really should pop it away. Oh. Oh. Okay, you may... Oh! hundreds of those um what we need to do as as i said change my weapon go back to the explosive there we go there we go there you go I need to, oh yes, I do need to go up that way. There's a chest there. I got a gravity gun now. It's a magnesis uh, rune. It means I can pick up metal metal objects. I've also got stasis plus uh, cryonesis. Uh, stasis can like use kinetic energy against a uh, thing, uh, fixing it in place, and then you can apply pressure to it, which will magnify it as well. Uh, cryonesis actually creates ice in wa from water, mainly platforms, to be honest. It doesn't actually freeze anything. Oh. Or not okay. But we'll do what we do with monsters sometimes. Timber. Okay, hey, just put you over there for a second. Put you over there for a second. There you go. You stick there. No, we tested that out in a dungeon the other day. Uh, it won't move, and it won't even connect to an item that I'm stood on. Kinesis uh, will freeze an item you are stood on, but you also then have to apply pressure to that item. Most people do it in the forms of putting a bomb underneath it first, then standing on a platform which the bomb is on top, uh, the bomb is underneath. And then setting the bomb off whilst it's in kinesis. Don't slip, don't slip. It slips. That's what it's trying to avoid. The problem is, is the gradient will be too... Yay! The gradient will be too slippery if I was to let it drop like that, because you can't actually climb on those metal doors. Uh... So, no air surfing like in Watch Dragon's Legion, then. Oh, yeah, no, you can. Um, let me get this first. You can. You can. You can. Um, okay. You. There are clips on it on the internet mainly YouTube shorts and stuff like that. Uh, one person managing to get from the uh, Twin Peaks, fighting Twin Peaks to all the way to Hyrulean Castle using a slab of stone, a bomb, kinesis, and magnesis. He 
you put the bomb underneath the slab of stone, kinesis the slab uh, the stone, uh, set the bomb off, which sent it into the uh, hurtling into the air, to which he then, uh, you know, slightly into uh. the air. Then activated kinesis again. Oh, sorry. Causing it to uh, freeze in mid air. Um, Hacked away at it with a big, massive, heavy, heavy sword. Climbed on top of the stone, and then the stone goes hurtling absolutely miles away. Now you can can actually continue this uh, this process by using the uh, kinesis and magnesis. Uh, kinesis um, by uh, uh, you know pausing the slab, quickly switch it, switch it, dropping a weapon, switching over to magnesis. Picking up the weapon with Magnesis and hitting the underside of the stone slab with the metal sword using Magnesis. Very difficult, but I've seen people do it. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. No, no way am I going to do it. <laughs> I could probably do the first days, Kinesis uh, bomb, easily. Yes, easily. But no way could I do the sword one. Now, which way are we actually going? Oh no, we gotta, we gotta, at this point, we've gotta make sure we try and talk to everybody in the stables. Oh, dragons. Okay. She's looking for dragons. We're looking for a stable hand which deals with saddles. Okay, all I see is a little kid. Oh no, there is a stable hand there. Okay, we're going to have to wait till day uh, morning then. There's got to be a fire about. I'm not spending money on a bloody bed when there's a fire. Who are you? Yeah. You a nomad? Suppose you already seen the horses around the uh, prairie then. I grew up taming horses around these parts. I'm confident there's not a rider in Hyrule better than me. You ought to ask the dude at the Twin Peaks uh, stable about that, mate. Uh, no, I'm not. No, that's what the dude at uh, obstacle course on horseback. No, 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 no. I haven't got an. I haven't got the appropriate saddle for that yet. Oh. Control your horse very well. That's the problem. Might find horse gear. Oh. Okay, thanks. <sighs> your first time here it's my first time i see these plains are home to many quality horses in the past nomadic tribes would gather here but <clears throat> nowadays bands of raiders roam the plains <laughs> acting like they own the place I can only hope that someone stops, uh, steps up to deal with these hooligans. Leave it to me. Oh, oh really? I'm so glad to hear that. I'm counting on you. What the hell was that? Hi! Hello there, traveller. Welcome to our stables. Stay a while, won't you? If you have a horse, you can help you change its gear or its main style. <laughs> Having to meet new horses to stop on by. Yeah! <laughs> Shh. 
Shush, Daddy. <laughs> okay, so I gotta bring my horse. Hey! Take a horse. Tea, Daddy. Mm -hmm. Take horse. Follow the path. If, if you're riding on a road, your horse will naturally follow the path as its instinct. Travel by road if you want to leave the steering up to your steed and just enjoy the scenery. Oh! Stop! Why did you walk in my way, you nunt? Yes, uh, of, of a sorts, apparently. I don't even need to activate, apparently. The horse will naturally follow. That's a mighty fine horse you have. If you're interested, may I help you change your horse's gear and mane? Yes, please. Oh, but you should know I'm only interested in horses that are raised with lots of love. Oh, yeah, believe me, I've got max affinity with them. Yes, I give them apples every time I ride them, which is the reason why I got no apples left. <laughs> just, uh, it's just a head over heels for you. That's uh, settles it. I'm glad he helped you out. Mm -hmm. uh... Character creation time. <laughs> any other bridles yet but you can help you put it on if you get one okay saddle don't have any saddles okay ah! we gave tea laddie blue hair everybody yay um let's give you let's let's give you a carrot shall we laddie let's give you a carrot i'm sure we've got another carrot Yes, we definitely picked up some more carrots. Here you go, laddie. Come on. I know you want it. Yes, there you go. See. Well done. heading now then. Uh, can I map it? Oh, come on now. Let's, let's, let's actually go and go get her then. Um, no, that's not what we wanted. We wanted to do that. And that. There we go. on the path. Nice. What a 
thing is, they're not really bandits either. They're more moblins. And I'm going down the wrong road. But he stayed on the road. He did. I know. Well done. Are you going to stop at the stable, or are you going to carry on riding down the road? Oh. He carried on the road. wasn't very safe, but he carried on down the road. That's cool. take control here. Well, let's see which way he goes. Okay, he went that way. We've got to go this way. It's all right, I know, I know, I know, I know. It's all right. We'll backtrack. We will. We'll backtrack. There we go. My dancing pony, everybody. Dancing pony. Dancing pony. Dancing pony. Dancing pony. Dancing pony. Can you hear me calling out your name? <laughs> I won't sing anymore because we'll get into trouble with copyright. I hear uh, archery. Uh... Ah, up there somewhere. Okay. Uh, put the master sword away, please. Uh, put it away, please. Thank you. I am sorry there, matey. Okay, let's get. We're going to the fairy fountain, okay? That's where we're going. Sorry, context. Um, there was an advert which had that prance, uh, dancing ponies in it. Uh, you probably have seen it on the in internet. It's been memed millions of times. It was to do with energy. Now, the spring, which has the name of a horse ruler, I believe it's here, because this is, um, this is literally Lake of the Horse God. So, oh, thank you for the follow. Thank you for the follow, Dizzy. Thank you. Thank you very much for joining us today. I hope you're doing well. I do hope you're doing well. We are just off with Tea Laddie right here. Off to the Great Fairies um, who bring horses back to life. Okay. Oh, I remember that. I'll deal with that later. Lucifer's just jealous because my tits are bigger than hers. <gasps> oh! <laughs> yep. Bold claim. Bold claim. Why did that cut off early? That was weird. Yeah, that's something which Rulo said. That's something which Lucifer said. It was funny. It was. It was. It was funny. That's the reason why I didn't dispute it, because it was Lucifer who actually clipped it. Boy! Sweet! 
Please, boy. Please, listen to my story. Sure. I am Malania. Hast thou, I mean, have you ever felt the pain of losing a horse companion? No, I haven't, because I take good care of my horses. If my power is returned to me, I may be able to help you out in some way. So please, I beg you, help me regain my power I've lost. All I need is a thousand rupees. And you too can be a fairy fountain goddess. <laughs> When my power has been restored, I should be able to be of use to you. Who loves horses so? Now, you have rupees for me, right? Hand them over, quickly! In order for me to regain my power, I need a thousand rupees. There you go. Sus, yes, it was sus. Thank you, boy. You are too kind. Well, I must say, mm. ho ho ho, at last, free of the tiny bud after so long, in my arms were the corporeal. Uh, if they were corporeal, they'd have cramped up for sure. And you, the one who set me free, are you not? Yes! My name is Milena. I am the god who watches over horses of this world. I suppose you deserve a reward for setting me free. What shall I do? <laughs> <laughs> Shall I make you my meal? <laughs> That's the jest. If a horse you love passes away from source, some sort of tragedy, fatal accident, it is within my power to revive that horse. However, if I detect a vile intent behind the death of your horse, you will suffer my wrath. <laughs> Only a jest. Let me see. Mm, I see you, you're good with horses. All seems to be well. The friendship you ex establish with your horses really is extraordinary. Remember that such a friendship is a two-way road. Horses care for you as much as you do for them. And that's it. <laughs> I was always going to say... I think this is the best looking fairy fountain out of all of them. And yes, that is the original track. That's all she wrote. Okay. Actually, you know, there's updrafts. Can we... No, we'll come back for that. Oh! The <laughs> Mother Melania loves her horses. Yes. <laughs> there you go. Sorry, T Laddie, but we gotta. <laughs> I gotta go and check that pond to see if there's a nice bridle for you. Although you are my actual slowest horse, but you've got the most sad stamina, which is the reason why I like you. Okay, we're gonna pop you here I can hear some weird noises coming from over there oh well it's the seashore no wonder I would okay we God Lake. Okay, first thing we're going to do, check the lake for any magnetic chests. <laughs> okay, saying that, right, I probably need the Samarina 
armor to actually get anything from the bottom of most people. No, I can't see anything. the rest of your work they do not work too hard okay do not work too hard at all man dog okay don't worry chappies i'm not too worried i'm wearing my climbing gear and i've got some stamina food with me as well yes definitely mate getting on winter now yes don't worry i probably will be Staying rather late today. Um, because I don't know whether or not Anne is going to be feeling good enough to be able to do what she needs to do. Um, that came across really wrong, but you know what I mean. She was poorly the other day. Uh, oh. No. Um, I'm not liking what's going into my head. <laughs> I'm not liking it at all. Long stream. Hopefully, 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 if that doesn't get too flipping ratty. Because all the, um, yes, no, no, Levine from Bones Musco, no, 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 where is it? Twilight Relic, no, Fairy Clothes, no, Ancient Mask, no, Mask Rumours. Uh, the trial, that's the one we have to go back to the Duke of Tree. We are looking for horse remnants, that's it. Uh, under the cherry blossom tree at a mountain where creatures gather, I assume that's where the Lord of the Mountain resides. That blue beast I was riding last room. Yeah, of course you take your time. No, 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 you take your time, matey. It is literally 5.30. And I don't usually, uh, until on Wednesdays, on Wednesdays I don't usually get off until 8 o'clock, so you've got plenty of time anyway, mate. Uh, the one we are currently up is a spring where horse spirit resides. Because this is this lake, this pond is literally known as the Lake of the Horse God. Then I saw that ramp and I had really bad thoughts. How you doing, laddie? You right? Good boy. Too bad I can't pat you whilst I'm stood on the ground. Oh. Oh, oh. Huh. Huh. Okay, let's continue. Huh. I I took into a stable to try and uh, see if I could actually, you know register him but they wouldn't accept him so I get, got off to attempt to feed him an apple and he uh, eventually just ran off I don't, to be honest, I don't think you're supposed to actually keep him. I 
don't think you are. Because there are other horses, rare horses in the game, as I've stipulated before. You've got uh, Europa, the actual original, um, Link's original horse. It's a rare breed to find. It's not actually a special horse, it's just a rare breed to find. Uh, the skeletal horses up in the north. Uh, I've gotten one of them before. I don't know how the hell I got it, but I got a photo of it. Um, then you've got the unicorn. Now I've heard tell of the unicorn. Oh, stop! Oh, thank you. Slow the heck. Slow your cacks, please, dirty laddie. Okay. I'm not liking these sounds, okay? And then, obviously, you got the horse that is not a horse. But is also not a skeleton horse. but we're not in tropical. You are confusing me. Okay, this is where the uh, road ends. Oh dear. Uh, please don't tell me you've got a name. Oi. No, you got a proper name. Good. Hello there. It's not every day that we see someone all the way out here. We're doing an ecological study of wild animals in this area. We heard that there was a giant horse living in the region. Apparently it can be found it can't be found anywhere else. That was all we needed to hear. We headed this way to investigate right away. A giant horse? Oh. The really big horse in this region is likely part of a rare local species. However, with all the monsters roaming around, we simply can't go any further. To be so close to discovery. Monsters, mm. that's right. There was even a monster that looked quite like a horse. I approached it thinking at first it was the giant horse we'd been looking for, but oh, it was terrible. Just from looking at it, you guess that you were uh, just... From looking at you, I guess that you were an adventurer, right? You certainly look strong. Hmm. How... Hey, how would you like to go and catch the giant horse for us? Leave it to me. Ooh. Although I don't want to give it to you. I want to have it. They say the giant horse lives around... ta o ab Grasslands. That'll be northwest of here. Do you think you could catch it and bring it back here? Don't stress out over the request though. You're talking about a giant horse, mate. Because I'm... Can't miss my dress oh. today. Jin. Hello there, young man. I can tell just by looking at you that you're a trained warrior. But tell me this. How confident are you in the ability to fight on horseback? Not very, mate. <coughs> Even in the Ocarina of Time, uh, Majorca Mask and Ocarina Time, I've never been good at horse combat. Uh, not too confident. Hmm, I don't like the sound of that. These monsters out, out this way are strong critters. 
You sure you don't want to drill with me some? Ah! No, uh, usually what I do is I just get off a horseback and just kill the damn things whilst I'm on foot. I don't want to put my horses at risk. Anyway, we're actually trying to get into the next region, aren't we? Yes, we are, T-Laddy. Yep. <laughs> we need to go... Up and rounds. We need to get to the wetlands first. So, south. That way. Run for your life! We're not being followed by the larynx. Okay. Let's get you something to eat, shall we? Yes. Let's get you something to eat. What do you want? You want a carrot? Or a radish? I don't think you eat radishes. Do you eat a coconut? Do you eat a coconut? Want a coconut? Oh, no. Run, laddie. I'll try and lead him away. Uh, yeah, I'm currently holding the Master Sword, so that's not good. No, we don't want that. We do not want the Master Sword. strange reason the Lawrence over there was actually glowing red. I have no idea why. Come on laddie. I oh, know we were supposed to give you food. But they stopped us. They're horrible. Let's just give you carrot. There we go. Well done. Ho ho! Ho ho! Where's the wolf? Ha! Taking one of them on with Laddie here. Ha! I need to get a hoop. I do need to get a hoop. I do need to get a hoop because some um, there's a mini side quest on top of the Deku tree. 
where I have to present items or uh, to solve riddles. And one of them is a booth. You get them from uh, Lawrence's. Yeah. It's alright, matey. You're fine. That is a big horse. Okay, now, I've actually been for a while now, about 15 minutes, been wanting to go and relieve myself. So, what I shall do is pop us on the Be Right's back screen and do a few shout outs. I'm just gonna go and get myself relieved and go and get myself some more tea. Probably a few biscuits, if that hasn't eaten them all already. I'm angry at him about that. So, I shall be right back. Do not worry. We are not going anywhere. And we're going to try and get this that horse after we've uh, finished. If I get to keep him, I'm going to call him Assam. <laughs> I do. I'll be well into my 40s. Or well, not well in. Just in things. No, well into. I don't know. Yes, well into. There's like a hidden path here. Hmm. Oh no, I fucked up. Pom pom. Okay, he's a hugger. Okay, right, we've got to kick these in the face again. <laughs> Ready? Wabosh! Oh, yes! Bowling! Woohoo! Alice is a speed caller. Is there a sure shot on this map? I do. No. Dead shot. Oh, Josh, found out information. There is a Bowie knife on Moon. Oh, is that? Yep. It's on the stairs uh, that you usually get trapped in where the, where the crawlers usually get to. Uh, you have to jump up to it. And there you go. Punch him in the anus. I will have fun with your face because you're a giant rhino guy. That totally didn't... No. 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 Nobody clicked that. that. That totally did not sound right. I don't know what the fuck he's doing at the moment. 
for a really to be honest, if he wanted you to go, he'd just pick you up. Yeah. Fuck you, bastard! Oh, dukes! <laughs> Alright, is that, is that okay? Okay, one more. Can you last go one more? I will bonk you so fucking hard. <laughs> yeah, what, no. uh, oh yeah, that's why I'm doing this. I'm really looking forward to it. All these promises. Uh, Tabby's still shooting me. Stop him. Starts talking to Get you fucking dead. There's fish <laughs> in the water. <laughs> uh, I knew it. No! Oh, really? We were already here. I don't remember seeing this even. Oh, this is, this is hot. Uh, Mash, thank you for being here. We're gonna go and we're gonna raid. Uh, we're gonna go raid Dustin. I don't know if he's still here listening. I don't know if he expects this or not. Uh, he does have a little jump scare when he gets raided, and it's quite entertaining. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and I forgot I need to copy this here. Here we go. Let's go to raid Chanel. Raid Chanel. I'm back, everybody. <laughs> there we go. Oh, how's everybody doing? Everybody get... Oh, G! Hello, G! Do you have a rope to catch the horse? Are there biscuits? Well... <laughs> How you doing, G? I hope you're doing well. Come on, let's, get, let's give G a shout out, shall we? G doesn't stream, but G's always around, so he deserves it. Oh. Oh, dear. Space, forward slash. Hmm. There we go. See, I totally need this tea. There we go. <laughs> How are you doing, G? Well, yes, no, this horse, um, we're supposed to catch one and take it over to those guys we were just talking to. I hope I get to keep it. And what you have to do is you have to be sneaky as anything. Don't startle them, but there's a lot of horses here. So, I'm going to have to try and wait until he's alone. Or where he's not being watched by the other horses. There we go. There's T Laddie. You gonna. These chappies. This may take some time. Aha, he's moving. Hey, 
I think what we're going to have to do Is he gonna be on the other bear bags? A little slight of him. Where'd he go? Oh! Bloody egg! I got stamina food on me, so it should be okay. I wish there was a hotkey for these sort of things. Everybody. Oh, look at him. He's angry though. It's alright, it's alright. So just ride you around here for a bit. I know, I know, I know. You do not like me on your back. No way are we going to get all the way back to those fellows and enter the stables. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> we got you, Link is literally having to do the splits to straddle this horse. There's a lot of thunder caps there. Well, we're going to end up back up this way anyway. I know, I know, I know. I know. Well, it's daytime now, so we're not going to get all these horrible skeletons turning up. It's just going to be Thunder Keys and Bandits we're going to have to worry about. Yes, I did it. I did it. There will come a time where I don't have to even worry about having to snack and stamina potions and food. Oh, and a yay. Okay, we just need to get past this Lawrence. I know, I know. Let's keep going. Oh, oh, oh. 
this over Lawrence now. We shall go the long way. Okay, bandits. <laughs> back to the campus. <laughs> that horse is huge. Yes, it's absolutely massive. I've never seen one that big. That is definitely an endemic species. Sorry, but can I take a good look at that horse? Go ahead. Just don't try and take him from me. Thanks. I'll be right back. Mm -hmm. This is impressive. Mm -hmm. uh, hmm. Quite interesting. Wow, with this much info, I can feel my spirit of discovery murmuring in contentment. It's definitely different seeing something with your own eyes rather than just reading about it. Thank you. Oh. This is to thank you for helping our investigation. 100 rupees, nice. To think that there is actually a horse this big out there. How surprising. There we go. Now let's take him back to the stable, get him registered. And we'll feed him up on some carrots. Oh. Well done. He's following the path already. Nice. Oh, 
Well done. I'm not even steering him. yourself a new steed. Do you want to race trip? Yes please. Gotcha. Aww. Oh what the hell? What does a dash on stamina mean? I surmise we'll find out. Yes. Thanks. Please enter the name of the horse. Assam. There we go. Ah. Yes. Registration complete. Would you like to take your all not who knew your horse? Yes, I'd like to take it. Ah. I'm gonna feed some carrot. <laughs> he's not grumpy now, so he's standing up straight. <laughs> oh my god, that's a freaking huge horse! <sighs> Let's all the carrots. There you go. <laughs> And uh, yeah, good. Right now, what are you clapping about, Beetle? Yeah, yeah. We'll take the <laughs> arrows. Get back on. <laughs> oh dear. There we go. Now, shall we go and give Assam a new haircut? I don't know. Let's go have a look. Mighty fine horse here. If you like, I can change its gear or maybe. Aww. Oh my goodness! There's no pony! It's so big! Aww. I'm sorry, but I don't think I have any gear that will fit such a large horse, and I bet it wouldn't like its mane handled. I'm sorry about that. Okay, that's no problem, mate. any stamina charges so that does, does that mean it has indefinite stamina <laughs> no no it has no stamina it won't go any faster 
No, yeah, it's shaking its head. That's all right, mate. You are a big horse. where the road ends okay uh no we're supposed to go down this way sorry mateys didn't mean to start with you Don't worry, tea laddie would have been bored at the moment. Hello, yes. <laughs> Hello, bits. Yes, I got myself a new horse. It's absolutely huge, and I called it Assam. Link is literally doing the split. We're trying to get to a new area. The desert area. At some point, we do have to let Tea Laddy stop. Because. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I know. Oh, oh. Because he will not go into this area. He won't. He won't go into there. just hit the great plateau but that's something what are you talking about you stupid silly sausages okay we shall leave Assam here <laughs> clumpy too <laughs> thank you Assam let's give you some carrots because you can't ride in deserts there we go all the carrots <laughs> There you go. Literally, <laughs> you can swallow my head. <sighs> no, you don't want the last carrot. No? No, you had too much. Okay, okay, okay. Well, thank you. We shall see you very shortly, okay? There you were.
change our gear to climbing. And... Ooh. What shall we wear? No. Let's go with a Nintendo. There we go. Nintendo Switch t-shirt. Damn, that's bright. Oh, an archery test. Come back now. So this is random. There you go. Okay, so basically we've got to try and make our way over there. And I do believe the fact that we are actually coming from the wrong angle. Yeah, up there. She's supposed to come through. I think it is. Yes. The actual canyon en entrance comes like. Yeah. Do behave. If you got a bow, you're not going to get me. further away than I think. Nope. That went over the top of it. What the hell? I 
I'm no good at judging distances. I can't do it in real life and I can't do it in computer games. Not unless there's some sort of reference. Um, yeah. We are going there. Soldiers claim or no, we don't need one of them. We will take a photo of it though. that a hell of a lot easier. Oh my! Have you got a fire rod? Can I have your fire rod please? your weapon. Oh. Yes! No, we need that. We need that. We need that. Uh, I want the fire rod. Thank you. We need that. Oh no! Where is it? Oh god, damn you! Once again, please be careful. It's the reason why I had to get up here because otherwise that skeleton would respawn again. And so has the wizard. Okay. Let's go along here. Hello, keys. Electric keys. Oh. There you go. That was actually further away than I thought it was. Pardon you, Daddy. Bit. What the hell are you doing up here? Okay, it looks like there's a... I mean, I can't use a map. It looks like there's a walkway over it. Over to it, sorry. 
Yeah. Let's go up. See if there's one way around this way. Something with not so many overhangs is what I'm looking for. Yes, that will do. I gotta make some more stamina, food, and potions, haven't I? This is as fast as we can climb. I do apologise. Oh no, wrong way. Oh, I've literally only got one left. light coming from okay the sun's not up yet how can i have a shadow weird climbing this one so we could use the land bridge to get over to the actual tower rather than walking all the way around the, the other side so i'm sure there's supposed to be a much easier way up okay if we're not careful we're gonna have to put on our bird gear soon get up here. Oh, sand. <gasps> oh. Okay. What we got here then? Oh no. Yes it is. It's swamp. Rivali's gale is now ready. Oh, go away you arrogant so and so. Oh, hello. Uh, I want 
trying to fish that amber out of that. Oh, hello! Sometimes. Okay, so we gotta get <laughs> onto the tower. I have done this before. I'm trying to remember how I did it. I think we did some weird sort of domino effect. Yeah, look, there's plenty of. Uh, yeah. Oh, it's a blue butterfly. Okay, I didn't need you. Okay, literally the shell stops there. Okay. I mean, I could easily flip and just build, uh, go to the cliff face, do a jump, and just, uh, you know, the uh, thing we got from the bird, and just do that. But I'm like, you know, I'm trying to do this the way which you have to do it without having that power. There you go.
Poo. I need another log then. Poo. the jump button jump that's what i ask you to do okay thank you yeah i hate swamp oh no here's one thing i didn't test oh things a lot more simpler <laughs> well you can see what I was doing can't you you can see what I was doing Turned on your PC. Aww. That's alright, Seb. Don't you worry. I'm getting tired. Yeah, basically what you're supposed to do is build a stack of... Uh, um... Iron blocks up there. I remember that this triggered me last time as well. It totally triggered me. Oh, okay. Look. We've got a bit of a wind problem going on there. So we might have to go to the opposite side. Do a jump glide. There we go. Not really how you're supposed to do it, but yeah. The easiest way of doing it. Yeah, what you're supposed to do is knock over those dominoes, build a stack of uh, blocks to that thing and then just climb it uh, up it that's what you're supposed to do if you don't have the me too power but also uh, as we found out cryosis works on it as well so you can actually freeze it to make a ice bridge but i slipped off and got ticked off with it Area. That wrong one. <laughs> Here we go. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, 
That is the canyon we were supposed to come in, yeah. I quote, quote 22, it is during our darkest moments that we must focus to see the light, IRL. Yes. Okay. So, I gotta add some more quotes. I have to. I've only got a few. Okay. The Greedo Canyon. Really, what I should do is actually go over here and walk our way around. So that's what I really should do. There is a stable in that canyon, you see. Um, it would be advisable for us to go in there. The reason why I haven't been in this area is eventually you guys will see, but there's a good reason I haven't been in that area. Yeah. And that's like the end area of the game. That's where Castle Hyrule is, and it's full of walking guardians. And I don't just mean the little ones which you get in dungeons. I'm talking about the big ones. Da -da 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 -da. Okay, type in exclamation mark, add quote. Da -da 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 -da. Okay. <laughs> In fact, I'll do it. Q U O T E space. Oh, you did it. Cool. At 36, is that all I've got? Mm. Oh, we're called. You think we've got a high flyer suit? <laughs> oh my god, Bagnifer! What the hell are you doing here? It's in you in ages. How are you doing? Well, you haven't been in chat for ages, I know that much. There we go. Oh. Been lurking at work. No, understandable, mate. Understandable. Oh, I'm on the plateau. There's a chest here, which I missed. Oh, it's an EX chest! Nice! Bomb arrows. Ooh. Okay, yeah. If I remember rightly, on one of those islands along that trail there, there is a Horrocks asleep. Bang's been here for a while. Yes, it's as he says. He does lurk quite a lot. Okay, I'm trying to figure out where I'm going to land. It's just land at the bridge. Whee! Hello! I ain't got no horsey with me, so I don't care. Oh, come on, run away, horsey. Oh, this uh, bow is breaking. These are the heavy duty enemies. You can tell by the fact that he's blue and he's covered in white tattoos. Running in the background on my computer, and sometimes I say hello. <laughs> oh no no I get multi streaming don't you worry mate yes no carry on you'll carry on no you're fine there you go go on run away horse do not get caught Oh, horse! 
Lucy. Stop getting caught. Thank you. Why do I hear sparkly sparkly? Yes, I see you in many a people's chat. I do. Debating coming back on this and doing master mode before the new one comes out. Yes. Yes. Definitely. I concur with that one, mate. I do concur. I've never actually completed this game. Um, it's always come to the point where I get to free beasts. And then... I either get called away to do another game, or somebody wants to do two player, or something stupid like that. You know, you know. And I never come back to it. By the time I do come back to it, if I do come back to it, okay. No, okay. Are we talk talking magnesis here? I think we're talking magnesis. <laughs> exactly that as well <laughs> Ooh. Uh, as uh, did Lucifer see the new setup which they have for the actual game list Canyon stables you want to stop before entering the desert yes I do that's the reason why I've come back here I need to finish NG plus uh, of God, uh, 2018, then play Ragnarok, uh, public testing for the new Mistland update, and the uh, Mistland update out for about Valheim, yes, 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 yes. And if you start Valheim, I'm going to get stuck <coughs> in for another 200 out, and if I start Valheim, uh, yes, yeah, yeah, no, totally. I get you, mate. I do. I do. The problem is, is that with that sort of game, I'm going to have to take my time to get my head around it anyway. I've already done one stream of it. The shrine's up there, by the way. Um, I had to... I did one stream of it. Anne keeps asking me to come into hers. And I'm like, I don't want to come into yours because I'll be asking... Go away. Way. Oh dear, I got the wrong arrows out again. You gotta run away now. Yeah? No. These are tougher than your average wolf. Whoa! Okay, calm down. Yep. There you go, there you go. They're gone. Um, too many, are asking too many questions. Too many questions. Uh, she probably gets that enough from Little Man. She doesn't need that from me. <laughs> okay. Oh, there it is. I know, I know, but, you know, there are different ways of playing Minecraft, and people, many different people have different ways of playing Minecraft. Oh, here we go. As you know, there's the builders, oh, go away. There's the builders, and there's the redstoners, there's the combat experts, there's even some, su some sub-genres as well. There's some people who even only play on blooming creative mode. They won't play on nothing else. And I get that. I do. Valheim is slightly different. 
Because no matter what you do, your settlements are always getting raided. <laughs> There's always a ground shaking or an awful stench comes from the forest. Uh, yeah, you play the games with friends to have fun. They want to share the game. They enjoy it. You're asking questions. It's a good, yeah, I know it's a good thing, but I'll be like, question, 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 question. Like uh, a five-year-old stuck in a Y cycle. <laughs> and Anne doesn't need that when, you know, oh, what the hell? Conveyor belt? Lino! On the move. Okay, what we gotta do? I mean, there are mods you can do to turn those off, thus they aren't super common. They, for sure, are rough when you're first starting though, yes. Yeah. Oh, okay, we've got to... Get the ball into that. I surmise they want us to do it by using... Just shooting it. Nope, dear. I twitched. Again. Oh, no. Oh! That whole platform must be con conical. There's no way. <laughs> Checking for chests. Always check for cheek secret chests. Oh my. Hello. As you can see, I'm sh uh, shooting them in their critical spot, which is their eye. So, that's what you have to do with those buggers. You're slow. Hurry up! Uh, doo -doo -doo. The trolls are the worst, Lamol. It's kind of that stage where you're not strong enough to kill them super easy and destroy your base super easy if they have the tree yes oh no oh. no i get you or as uh, Anne keeps calling it the stick <laughs> oh here it comes here it comes i see its glow uh, halfway there, a night city. Oh. Gimli's gone live. He's currently playing uh, Cyberpunk. And he says he's halfway through the storyline. I just see it pop up on my phone. I thought I heard something grinding. Oh, it's a laser. Well, we know with lasers that the fact that we can actually um, stop them with the kinesis machine. <laughs> yeah, swinging around their big stick. Yes. I'm gonna figure out if anything comes out of this conveyor belt. Oh, there's a chest on there. Is that a metal chest? Yeah. 
Yes, got it. Please be a ball. Please be a ball. Ah, there's the ball. the wrong way. You stay there. Pick up! We can't sprint, that's the problem. We sprint, we drop it. Discord and mine to in a mo. All I need to do is make the coffee and start the game up, and I'll hit go. But I'm just sat here. That's all right, Macy. Where are we at? What is the time? Well, I got I got a whole hour until my normal stream time ends. Whenever you feel you want to go, you go. Oh, the notification for Gimli. Okay. Yeah, I went a bit early today. I wanted to get... I wanted to get... It's mainly because I wanted to do stuff in Zelda, but there were parts which I couldn't do because they were main storyline or they were important on showing how somebody could get something and stuff like that. It got to the point where I went and saved the wife of that Zora male. When I turned around, I said, no, I can't do any more off stream. Oh, we got four spirit orbs now. Cool, we can get some more stamina. not be a member of the clan. I bet you are. I'm not trusting you. <laughs> ah, Yoda clan. <laughs> ah. Go away, Yoda clan. We don't need that. I would like one of their bows though. Uh, 
There's supposed to be a clan which is supposed to be opposite the Sh Sh Sheikah tribe. And they're supposed to be helping Calam Calamity Ganon. Which kind of like makes them a bit short-sighted in the fact that Calamity Ganon wants to destroy the world. And I don't even know why Calamity Ganon wants to destroy the world. It's never been really made clear. Slap his ass. Get away. Yes, totally. Oh, we just got another notification. We get something in interesting things. Keep walking, okay? Okay, if I remember, this is a side mission. Yes, it is. Ah. Hey, hey, I sure wasn't expecting to meet anyone out here. Maybe this is just the upturn in luck I need. Yes, yeah, so I'm a traveller like you, and I was attacked by a monster in the, the, this very canyon. Uh, yeah. Ah. Uh... That's when my partner, that is to say my horse, ran off, and they, and hey, I've been stranded here ever since. Ah. Uh... Hey, yeah, if I could just, uh, if I could just had a horse, I could continue my travels, and you're a fellow traveller, so I have to ask, right? If you, on your travels, you see a horse that would suit me, would you sell it to me for a hundred, no, three hundred rupees? Yeah, you got it, mate. Mm. Hey, thanks. But don't bring me too big a horse. Won't be able to ride it. No, I need a suitably sized horse. Uh, yeah. You're going to be waiting a while, mate, anyway. that wood. Anyway, the horse stables is literally just around the corner, mate. You're useless. And plus, all I've seen is keys. Keys and moblins. If you can't run past them, you know you're not used. You're not. You shouldn't be a traveller. Honest, this section would have been a lot more interesting, right? If you had to ride it on a horse and you had moblins in that lot, which you had to shoot. There are moblins in that lot up there, it's just they're all on the top of the cliff face. I assume they didn't, uh, that was the original idea, but they stopped to do, probably stopped doing it because it probably would have took too much computing power. We are talking about a switch here. Not like it's a Wii or Wii U. Oh, has any, anybody seen the new Logitech yet? The Logitech handheld. Which is going to be concentrating on um, how gaming. You guys. just went live.
Oh, Lusty did too. Oh, well, I did see another message creep up, but I assumed that was the notification that uh, Eurogamer has released a new article. Probably something to do with Xbox Blooming Gold again. Yeah, it's scheduled digest from Eurogamer. Explanation mark SM, explanation mark lessons, explanation mark YouTube. Okay. A wild dom, a, a dino has summoned. Is that sound? Oh, is that? <laughs> oh, I just pinged a rupee somewhere. There it is. Yes, sand. They put the sound effect for falling sand into the game. Uh, I'm going to make some coffee and start mine up. Ha ha. Night for everybody going live. I have... <coughs> I have been contemplating should I add an extra day in on streaming because I, I'm... Literally, I'm off until next Monday. I have been contemplating that. I don't know, though. First, first blooming week off in about a year, of course. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're coming on the stables. You can hear the shrine. Of course, it won't appear on the map until you actually discover it. Either of them. Yep, you can hear the music now. There's a quarry. Got any rush rooms? Yes, I have. Uh, uh, see, I'm so tired. I'm tired of going normal speed, I mean. The first I tried rush rooms was when I was five years old. And come to think of it, I ate them every day since without fail. Back in the day, I'd win every race I ran thanks to those things. Uh, Cut to 55 years later. Now I can barely drag these bones off the ground without these rush rooms. That's what you get for being an addict, mate. But, but no matter how many I ate to fortify myself, I'm just too old to get up to the cliffs to pick mushrooms where they grow. Oh. That's why I'm letting all able bodies sort know what I'm in the market for. Um, I'll give them a diamond for 55 mushrooms. That's worth the effort. I wouldn't say so many. If you want to do business, just come to talk to me. I'm always here. Ah. There you go, May. Ah. Oh, 55, okay. Wait, how many ah. have I got? Oh, I've only got 21. I've been saving them all game. Uh, where's the shrine gone? <laughs> He's so hot. Uh. 
Ah. My four friend. Hey, did you happen to see any of my friends? There are four travellers named Olif, Felix, Han, Olum, and Prime. Me. <sighs> I don't know. We were all walking together when some monster suddenly jumped us near the Kunot Plateau Path. I took off running and didn't stop until I got here. Mm. I thought my friends were right behind me, but when I turned around, they were nowhere to be found. I don't think the monsters could have... No, they're fine. They'll just be back any second now. Hey, if you happen to run into any of the friends on the road, please let me them know that C. Sammy... Sesame... <laughs> is waiting for them here. We're picking up side quests like anything. Hello, chilies. We'll need you later. But it's the herbs we actually need. Anyone need some bugs? No, I don't. But if you've got some rare bugs, Beetle will take them off your hand. Okay. Talk to you. Oh, I know exactly where that is. Well, I haven't been collecting them at all. I really should. But as I said, I've been trying to not collect them so that I can do it all in one stream. Savach. Mm? How do you wring such strength, such endurance out of that rusty body? Ah. A runty body. Very few have ever seen Leviathan bones, but keep an eye out in the desert and you might just get lucky. Yeah, I know. I was supposed to find four sets of Leviathan bones and take pictures of them. Where's this ready shrine? Up there, apparently. Stop pitching. Yeah. Apparently there's a pond up there as well. Yeah, okay, here we go. <laughs> right, do you mind? Start climbing, please. I can't rely on my bloody... Jump glide all the time. <laughs> oh yeah, there it is. <laughs> What we got? Oh, it's... I hear electricity. Whoa! <laughs> what the hell? To you who sets foot in the shrine, I am K Noah. In the name of the goddess of Hyrule, I offer you this file. Okay. Okay, don't you worry. I shall get to the trading post and I shall call it. We shall raid Lucifer. <laughs> I don't think you needed to freeze the scene for that, mate. I think we all knew that was going to happen. Ah. Can we use magnesis on these? Yes, we can. Um... Uh -huh. 
Yeah, don't get stuck on the water scene. No, that's the small key. That's not the silver key. We have had a silver key before, but I can't remember where we found it. Silver keys is what you got on all the other dungeons in Zelda games. Oh, you got armor, have you? Whoa, okay. He's a actual laser dude as well. Interesting. Okay, that's that bogon. What you got? Yeah, but which type of guardian sword? Come on now. We gotta know. Durability up. Good. Nice switch. Okay, so we need... Aha. Uh -huh. There you go. Me! Come on! I, am, I haven't come across a secret chest yet, though. Did we? Did we come across a secret chest? by the way. Uh, you keep going as long as you want. <sighs> that was piss easy. There you go. In reality, according to the story, main storyline, um, as we say, Great Plateau, Hen uh, Kaiko Village, Hento Village, Hento Village, Sora Domain, Goron Domain, Guido Domain, then Rito Domain. But you're not supposed to explore everyone in a single sitting. You're supposed to get to a certain point, stop, go back, you know. I don't mean see single sitting. I mean, uh, when you enter an area, explore everywhere. I know most role-playing games that is the thing <clears throat> but because certain powers and certain um things allow you to do certain things like this whole me glide jumping being a whole thing uh yeah there it is Whoa! You cannot blame the rain, mister. There is no rain in a desert. Why it's called a desert. Any more rust rooms on this pillar? No. No, but there was a key keystone. Oh, damn you. <laughs> Lucifer Angel has gone live! Go check it out. 
at everyone I've gone live come join in say hi show some love or just look always great to see you Okay, we'll have some random dude stop us. And he'll be like, Oh, you can't go out there without a potion. Ma, ma, ma. I'll do it for the storyline. We'll get to a certain point. Apparently it'll get too hot for us. Although it's just turning, it's starting to turn night. So I don't think that's going to happen. Oh, is that the sun coming up? I don't know. Sava, I can't Sava. tell. It's all going on today. No. Mm? It's, if you're searching for Alisa, legendary treasure hunter, then you search is over. You're looking at her. Mm. I've been in the game for 20 years. When I set my sights on the treasure, you can be sure I'll claim it. Okay, if you say so. Yeah, it's just about to turn night time, so we're okay. That is one legit way to pa uh, pass the desert. In fact, it actually gets quite cold in the desert during the night time. We have to follow this pathway. At this moment in time, because we haven't got the right gear on. Because you could fall foul to uh, quicksand. And obviously, as you can see, there are oh, local sandstorms. You can actually see it walking around. It will. Uh, you can't actually approach it yet because the sandstorm will swallow you just like the uh, the forest did. Sava, Sava. Sava, Sava. This is the Kora, Kora Bazaar. Guido Town is still a fair distance southwest of here. If you've headed there, you should consider resting a bit. Though you are a foe, even if you make it to the town, you won't be able to get in. All the same, the Divine Beast is kicking up a storm right now, so I don't recommend going to Guido Town. Guido Town? Oh. It's to the southwest. It is the biggest town in the area. It's the only town in the area. This is a trading post. Uh, it's famous for trade, and it's also for staying active and vibrant all night long. However, there is a law forbidding bow males from entering the city. Divine Beast. Mm -hmm. What do you know about Divine Beast bow Nabrois? Nabrois. Nabrois. Suddenly, it is the guardian deity for the Greedo people, but it suddenly started acting up, up a while back. There's nothing we can do to stop it either. It's protected by a fierce sandstorm and intense lightning. 
though it hasn't yet it could easily head towards Greedo Town or this oasis I do my best to keep an eye on it from here thank you mm -hmm. uh, I don't need any thanks this is my job after all you know the desert is hot during the day and cold at night it'll take the energy out of you in no time if you plan to head out into the desert make sure you go prepared yeah i've got plenty of heat protection potions oh no no so why is because yeah that's the memory we can't go over there <laughs> Bazak! Sabu, sabu! What's a let down? Oh! No, don't want to climb the torches. Bananas, melons. Hello, doggy! Uh, she's asleep. I think that's the person we've got to talk to about going to Teletown. Kicking back in the Cora Cora Bazaar, making small talk with the lovely Greedo. Good times, good times. Hey, don't get me wrong. It's all part of the job. Have you you have to make friends to make money. I want I want some apples. Yes, I'll have some apples. Oh. But I have your arrows. I'm gonna take your apples. <laughs> Oh dear. Ah. No. Oh. I only do that because I'm getting to the point where I keep forgetting to pick the apples. Hello there. What am I going to do? Yo. Good evening. So I guess it's Sava Sava. Hey, Greedo, isn't it? Yeah, well, I'm a high rollie, so don't worry about it. Before I say any more, have we met before? Kind of. Come here. Uh, I came here from Rito Village. Rito Village. Ah. Oh. I should have said I've been there. Because <laughs> I'm wearing the outfit. I had a great pan, you know. I left Rito Village to try and earn some money out in the world. But it's so incredibly hot here during the day, it's been tough to work up the wheel to go any further. I would like to see Greedo Town, looks like even if I can't go inside. Yeah, I can. are you a male? I think you're a male, I think you're a male. Uh, it's just so hot. I heard there is an elixir that can help beat the heat. It's made from insects with cooling effects and monster parts. Yes, I've got plenty of them. Ah. But they don't seem to be selling the elixir anywhere. No, of course they don't. You get the insects in that lot from the colds area. I've, been, uh, I've heard insects with cooling effects live in the cold parts of the Greedo Highlands. Okay, do they? Cool. Hmm. Well, the monsters there are rough to say the least, so I'm not having a lot of success getting myself motivated. I am sorry. Sorry for yawning, champions. Uh, any more stalls? No. Greedo Sigma. Hello, Beetle! Hey! We meet again. Ah. What are you looking for? What are you selling? I'm sure I have something for you. Well, there you go, Mr. Birdie. There's the, some gold deniers. You can have those. Make your own elixir. There's a cooking pot over that way. <laughs> oh, Seb. <laughs> Potato and a shark wearing a scar. Or is it a dolphin? Let's enlarge that. Have a look. Oh, it is a shark. Wow! It's a shark eating a potato. Okay. 
Okay, uh, yeah, let's have a bed. Let's get some... Oh, yes, no, they sell all the arrows here, don't they? How many do you have in stock, or do you have, like, infinite? I can't remember. Oops. What was I stuck on just there? That was weird. 12 in star, uh, 12 in my inventory, 15 in my inventory, 10 in my inventory. Ha ha, goes goose, but shark fall. Oh, okay. What, you literally bought either What? Huh? Vasak. Sorry, Vasak. I want to buy. Oh. Only sell arrows. They're on the counter to your left. If you're looking for something else, try Guido Town. Oh, right. Vo aren't allowed in Guido Town. Yeah. Hmm? Did you need something? Yeah, I want to know why you've only got, like, one arrow. Ah. Oh. Yeah, they're literally only they're selling one arrow at a time. That's not worth anything. Hello. Mm. Savach. Uh, Divine Beast, it feels like it's got a little bit closer and closer every day. Ah. I wonder how long it'll be before I can get back to Guido Town. Ah. Uh, when I say Divine Beast, I'm talking about the giant thing roaming around in the desert. It's been kicking up a bad sandstorm and it's apparently it will blast you with lightning if you get too close. Mm. The thought of it getting zapped is terrifying. I can't risk travelling to Guido Town. Guido Town? Mm. There's a town in the southwest I made up almost uh southwest made up almost entirely of Guido. It's the largest settlement in these parts. It's got a lovely market and a canteen. The town's active from morning to night, mm. but, well, if you have a rule that will affect you guys aren't allowed in. No foe may enter, they say. Ah. Uh. Gert, yeah, we lost a lot of business ever since the Divine Beast started stomping out in the desert. The sounds of the Divine Beast walking might be loud, but the beds are still comfy. Do you want to stay? Yes, I do. That's the reason why I came in here. I'll take the regular, please. Ah. Oh. Till morning. Okay, don't eat oversleep, Sabor. How dare you? There we go. Savata. Savata. Hope you slept well, take care, and safe travels to you. Okay, now with that, we're safe. And we are going to go and raid Lucifer. Yeah? Good idea? Just put it on the chat screen. Okay, chappies. So, yes. Thank you very much, G Snap. Thank you very, very much for being here today. Uh, I want to thank Seb. I want to thank G Snap. I want to thank Lee Lucifer. And uh, this, I want to thank Dizzy again. Well, I say again. I suspicion that the fact that's the same person from yesterday. Yes, most definitely. I was, as I said, I was contemplating whether or not I should actually stream tomorrow. Um. Tomorrow's a uh, Thursday, so yeah, I could stream tomorrow. I could, but make it an afternoon stream. I can definitely stream. Um, yeah, I'll just start in the afternoon and see how long I can go until one of our group uh, comes on. Yeah, 
so yeah i'd say tomorrow two o'clock ish okay <laughs> thank you very much everybody for coming thank you g snap thank you seb thank you man dog uh although he's still at work so um so yeah we're all gonna raid lucifer let's i would help if i actually had the button up yeah, no Ben's live as well. Everybody's bloody live. These people weren't lying. There we go. There we go. Is that got it? Are we reading? <clears throat> I don't think we are. Uh, okay. I can't see the raid chat. There it is. There it goes. Excellent. Cool. Again, I see you all tomorrow. Um, oh, yes. Thank you very much for coming, Bits and Craft. Thank you. Link's currently clapping his hands. That's very disconcerting. <laughs> I shall stick us on the end screen. I shall do a few shout outs whilst it rays out for us now. Okay. See you all tomorrow. Bye, -zy bye. Totally sinking when we can actually, like, speed the ground. <laughs> That's funny. Less yawning, more death. Why my gun is invisible and I can't really shoot with that. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going pew.